What's up guys welcome back this is Gaming Glossy Thor so today i'm going to tell you how you can broadcast your gameplay from your PlayStation 4 so first of all open the game whichever you want to play so go on the game and press x and let the game open so there we are with Fortnite i'm just doing for example you can just stream any game but i'm doing Fortnite for a purpose Okay so there our game is open so I'm not going to play any mode so you've got to press the share button that's over right here i hope you guys can see come on get the focus yeah this share button come on come on focus <laughs> come on man yep so what is is just a button over here you've got to press this so Once you press this, you're gonna get the option of broadcast gameplay. Now press X on this, and it says please wait, and then you can select what you want to choose, like Twitch or YouTube. So I mean, like the procedure is all the same. So you've got to select YouTube. It would ask you to sign in. So I've already signed in, so it, it won't ask me. So as you can see, you got many things over here. So. First of all you need to switch this thing off like display message to spectators and spectators comment because this can create a problem in gameplay now if you want a voice over a commentary in a video then make sure that include microphone audio and broadcast is switched on now here you can put your title let me just edit it like the last stream i did was horizon zero dawn that's why it's written that so for example i can take um live but um you guys can give any title Uh, there's a description which is pre-typed but you can change it if you want to now here you select the resolution of your video you can select according to your internet speed i mean like if it is damn high then you can stream at 720p 60 fps or and if it is damn low then you may stream at 360p standard it doesn't really matter it depends but if you will stream on 60 fps then the gameplay recording would be paused then This includes these things that uh, privacy and tags. You can add additional tags. Well, some tags are pre-typed. You can include include your online gaming ID, or you can't if you don't want to. You can send invitations to some players, and then you go on start broadcasting, and your stream would start. Now, let me just show you. I mean, like the moment you tap on start broadcasting. and you've just got to wait for a few moments and then it would show on air that means that your live stream has started and you're live and you can just do whatever you want now when you want to stop the stream you got to press the share button again and like i hope you guys now know where this button is this stand button like why the hell can i get the focus on it yeah this button tap it again and then you're going to get the option of broadcast settings go to this and then you can stop broadcasting it should ask you that the broadcast will be stop confirm it to stop your broadcast and it will so show you that the gameplay recording was resumed all right guys thank you like this video if you enjoyed and i'll see you guys in the next video till then goodbye subscribe to my channel become bullshit